you'll just go go nuts and just fly off the stage. Oh wait, I can fly. Well, why are you flying there? Oh no, camera guy. Oh, now you want to be friends. Shut up, Sonic. Just working partners, if you don't mind. <laughs> oh. Ah. <laughs> you have a lot less sense of direction when you're playing this level as Tails. Oh my gosh! Even, even though the level is like basically identical to when you're playing it as Sonic, it's just when you're Tails, you're like, I can fly! <laughs> fly everywhere! I'm not just saying, like, you. It just happens. Yeah. Jump! What the? No. Get, you stop. have to press A to jump off of it. We. Woo! Oh, yeah! Sonic! Yeah! Sonic game! <laughs> I'm in a Sonic game! I forgot for a second. Camera guy. What are you doing? Camera guy! That was There's your springs fault. there. No, camera guy. That was not camera guy's fault. Yes, it was. Look how far ahead of Sonic you are. If you pay attention to those icon, he's gonna start rubber banding really hard. Really? Yeah. Will it be a problem? No. You know what? Ooh. Hmm. You're lucky you're invincible. <laughs> Go! Yeah, whatever. Oh my <laughs> gosh! <laughs> See, Sonic's rubber banding really hard right now. Or he was. He was when I started that sentence. <laughs> uh, so, yep. This is Tails' fourth level. So, there's one more after this. The his fifth level is actually my favorite. Woo! Good thing I released these animals so that cannon didn't shoot me. Yep. So like obviously Tails version of Skydex a lot shorter than Sonic's. Just I don't know that it necessarily should be, but it is. Because it's like the levels are loaded in different segments, so like because you're racing Sonic, you can't go through different segments. Yeah. yeah. You technically could, but... Woo! <laughs> While I do this! Yeah, party! If you'll pay attention, he's like switching between twirling on his hand and his foot. Really? Yeah. Huh. I feel like it's hard to get a good angle on it here. This is... Where's his foot? Or wait. Sorta. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Take my word for it. Okay. But I don't know. I think that's really cool. I really like that power. <laughs> <laughs> Even if it's not useful. <laughs> it's just awesome. Here <coughs> <laughs> you go. Hey, you know that awesome power up? Use it in this character battle. I don't even know how to use it. How do you use it? You hold down X. Okay. Or B. I'm going to hold X to win. Yeah. <laughs> Just like Sonic Unleashed. No. <laughs> That's not true at all. <laughs> but I'm like, uh, as a matter of fact, I had you play the day levels of Sonic Unleashed. Yeah, they were fun. And they were fun. But when it came to Jungle Joyride, I was like, here's a level where you'll probably die a lot. You want me to just show it to you? And you're like, yes. <laughs> <laughs> I think Jungle Joyride is a super awesome level. I don't remember I think it's, it. It's my or favorite not, level in not it. Not explicitly, anyways. It has a lot of like really cool set pieces. Set pieces are like a... When I was playing Sonic Generations, there was some like cool stuff. Yeah. Like, I didn't... I wouldn't really think of... Set pieces are like huge in Sonic. Yeah. It, it wouldn't occur to me otherwise, but... They're kind of awesome. Yep. Get him. Get him so hard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm freaking tails. What you got? I'm gonna get you, Gamma. What? Amy. What? 
I have to kill this <laughs> robot. Step aside, Amy. That was like a mature thing to say. Move aside, Amy. Get out of the way. Yeah, that's basically what Sonic says when Sonic's in that position instead. As is most likely canon, because that's how it is in all the other yeah. characters' events. Like, obviously Sonic's in that position in Amy's and Gamma's and Sonic's story, so it's most likely Sonic. <laughs> Waggle my eyebrows. <laughs> You need to be do him. Okay, I'll save her. But I won't spin my tails. Okay, I will. Just a little bit. How about you, robot that I didn't just kill? Are you okay? Alright. Cool. <laughs> Let's get the hell out of here. So coming up is um Tails is I hope I'm not naming this trope wrong, but I want to say character event horizon. I don't know. Well, it's kind of important to his character. In this game, at least, they kind of just... They ignore it after Sonic Adventure 2. Tails has self-esteem and is independent. <laughs> <laughs> Tails! Tails, you're not spinning your... Tails! There's no reason you should be falling slowly! <laughs> it's a video game! doesn't really excuse it. It's a video game. Eggman. And there's Eggman. <laughs> Which is just... Huh? Okay. What are you doing, Takao? It's floating around. That building looks like it had A's on the top. Did you see that? Huh? Like on the banner? Here, I'll show you. It's right there. You see it? Where? Uh, never mind. I'll show you once we're in the adventure Is field. it just like a triangle pattern? Yeah, it's like a triangle pattern. It is looks it like in the, the top right there? Yeah. Those little yep. squares. Mm -hmm. Okay, I guess I know what you meant. It looks like it's just going. Ah! Wait, Eggman's being dramatic. Huh? Why? What? Well, humping what is... your Eggmobile is not going to do that. <laughs> <laughs> what is his motivation for all of this? Um, he was going to destroy Station Square and big build Eggman Land on top of it. Or so Robotnik for, land. So, so for real estate. Yeah, I guess it's... It's kind of... Like, Eggman's motivation in a lot of the games has been, I'm going to build Eggman land slash Robotnik land, whatever. So, he's going to launch a missile at Station Square. Okay, then. <laughs> Dale's just like, holy crap, I'm in Station Square. That's like... That's something that happens... In real Band. life. Nuclear. And... And... Tails like, hmm? What? Cop out! No. <laughs> <laughs> Tails could have had some real character development. He would have been Being like, I saw that missile go, but I didn't stop it. <laughs> And now Station Square is destroyed. So Eggman's going to go and detonate it when he's right there. So he's kind of insane at this point. Hmm. Yep. Or maybe he'll like adjust it and then remotely detonate it. But still. The idea is he's going to go detonate it. Yeah. Right there. So. What? Tails, go stop Eggman. This is true. Go stop Eggman. Y yeah? Okay, it is kind of realistic, because he's like, he's eight years old, and he's going to go stop a mad scientist. That His cool big brother guy always goes in the <laughs> Go, man. <laughs> what? <laughs> that was the epitome of dialogue. Yep. Wait, am I just racing him? Yes. Oh. Were you trying to attack him? Yeah, I was. Uh Just die. <laughs> they found my remains later that day. No, they didn't. Station Square blew up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> is this Station Square? Kind. Of. Well, Station Square is like the blocks around the train station. But this is like the city that Station Square is in. So, yeah. 
a lot of people uh, think, and it might actually be true, that um, Station Square is oh, the name wait. of the city. Oh. Okay. Yeah, I don't know why you didn't go for the dash rings instead. Whatever. Shh. Yeah, uh, do it. Oh. Nope. Is there any way for me to survive this? Sure. Your yeah. tails. <laughs> what way am I supposed to go? Up towards the dash pads. Oh, I didn't see them. Follow the dash pads. They always know the right way. Up Woo! And down, all around. Up and down and all around. So, you know how this level was pretty insignificant for Sonic Story? Yeah. It's the climax of Tails' story. That's so, symbolic. So, that's cool.